How do? Uh, little change of scenery tonight. I'm not doing any like work work. I'm just clearing bits of space in the workshop. So this is a little stove which has fire inside. Yeah, stick a bit more in I think. Yeah. Just in case you didn't know how a stove worked. Uh, let's have a bit of a plastic fire lighter in. That'll go away, can you, in a minute. Right, this is where the big dwarf stove is going to go. I did this last year, I think. Maybe it was the year before. Um, so, yeah, that's where it's going to go. Um, little bits of firewood. Found some rat shit down there, which I wasn't very happy at. And there was also some rat shit down there. So, if I zoom in, set a little trap out with some poison on, because rats are just one of the few creatures in the world I don't like. Horrible little bastards. So, I've got... Sand and cement. Well, there's some cement. There's some sand knocking around somewhere, which I'm still to fill all of that bit in. Um, I'm going to stick a load of poison down the back as well. Uh, and then there's actually the floor completed. Um, there's a gap. Then is it going to do it? Yeah. So there's a draft coming from under the door. I dare say you would have believed it, but uh, just in case you didn't see it. <laughs> yeah, so there's a draft, so there's a few more little bits of drafts I need to block up. should we call the workshop breeze home so eventually this is all gonna this is gonna come out um, for all supposed to be in a dwarf stove it's gonna end up about well probably comfortably the same height as those hooks so he's gonna be an extremely tall dwarf um, oh, just to show off that was a little hook I rescued from somewhere. This was a, a gate latch, spring latch, which I dug up in my garden. And it was the first piece of wrought iron I actually managed to get my hands on. Uh, it had some nice gnarly rust and corrosion on. So, you know, I just forged that bit round. Uh, got some twists on there. Just like that, put it round in a curly hook, and I can dangle a lantern off. Uh, and that as well. There's something else I could dangle off there if I wanted. Uh, but saying that if I do that, then it actually clashes on there, so it's actually not that good an idea. Put in mind. So, yeah, well, yeah, there's some firewood. I don't quite know what else to say at the minute. Um, yeah, it's uh, fairly wild outside, it's been wild all weekend, so I decided I wasn't going to do a great lot of work and I needed a rest. There you go, fireworks. Except not fireworks, because that would be dangerous, but the fire works. Um, so, well, once I'm a bit more organised in here, uh, I'll get things set up. So bits of cables, got that. Oh, got my lathe, which is still sitting there not doing anything. Uh, axe handle, there's another, well, three axes or something like that down there, plus sledgehammers, just in case, plus a scythe, in case I fancy being the Grim Reaper. Um, 
yeah I'm just randomly waffling now so no real work tonight because I cannot be bothered uh, and it's blowing a hooligan outside and it's pissing down as you can hear so I've actually made the bit of space that I need to so I need to get right well I'll sit down a little bit get that filled in sand cement uh, and I can probably shove a few things out to store out the way um, there's lots of future projects I believe that wood there was from Snorri and I think I said I was going to make a little chest for him I think some are like that anyway so there's uh, some of these bits of firewood some of these are well probably project wood firewood wood to move around somewhere else while I trip over it uh, yeah so hopefully next few days this will look a bit tidier well maybe it's not next few days but sometime I'm rambling now I'm gonna go and have me tea right just a quick update see you in a bit